A lot of people love to go to sleep at night because you get to turn your brain off. But what if you only had to turn off one half of your brain at a time? What we're dreaming about here is unihemispheric sleep. And it does exist, only not for humans. As much as we talk about sleeping with one eye open, it's not something we've really evolved to do. Whales and dolphins, on the other hand, live in a much more violent world. And they're conscious breathers to boot, meaning they have to consciously decide to take each breath. So they need to be awake all the time, or at least partially so. So whales and dolphins will engage in unihemispheric sleep. We know this from looking at brain scans, from looking at EEGs. What they'll do is just shut down half the brain while the other half remains active. And they'll do this for upwards of eight hours a day. So again, humans cannot do this. But what would it be like if we could? Well, we have a few theories about that. Scientists speculate that it would be kind of like that stage you're in right before you fall asleep at night. You're reading your book, you're, you're drifting away, but you're just conscious enough to where you're aware of your surroundings and can pop to if need be. We can also look to science fiction for ideas about what human unihemispheric sleep might consist of. For example, one of my favorite science fiction authors is Ian M. Banks, and he wrote a book titled Consider Phlebas, in which we encounter a character who experiences unihemispheric sleep so that he can constantly keep tabs on his crewmates. So a third of the time, he is dreamy and vague. Another third of the time, he's all logic and numbers. And then the remaining third of the time, that's when his brain is fully awake and you get the complete individual. Now this book was written in 1987 and it does employ the myth of the left brain, right brain. However, it still raises some very interesting questions. And indeed, if you could put half of your brain to sleep and the other half remained awake, how would that change who you are? So what about you? Would you sign up for this? If we could just do a little procedure on your brain and make it possible for you to engage in unihemispheric sleep, would you do it or do you want to keep sleep the way it is? Let us know. You can leave a comment below, you can leave a video response, and don't forget to subscribe so you can check out even more mind-blowing videos.